We're taking a break, but next we'll see how local designs go from sketch to screen to ink on a t-shirt. Well, no surprise here. There's yet another new store open in Duluth's Lincoln Park neighborhood. It feels like it's happening constantly. But we got to see the process start to finish of how these custom graphic tees get here to Superior Thread Collective. All right, we get to go to the start of the process, kind of the start of the process here with Colton. And Colton, tell us what you do. Uh, yeah, I'm a graph designer for On The Limit. And this fascinates me. The process actually starts on paper. So yep. where do things go once these drawings are, are done? We put them in the scanner and we scan them in. Okay. And then I put it into my design software. So now you can scale this to be whatever size you want. Oh, wow. You can you can shrink it down to the size of a pencil tip. You can expand it to the size of a billboard. Like these small little gaps, we, we want to make sure that the ink doesn't fill that in. And the mm. lines are thick enough so when the screens are burnt and the ink gets passed over the screens, the ink fills those lines. Right. If we don't know what color we want to put it on. Yeah. We then find t-shirts, garments, whatever, and we create mock-ups, proofs of what this design would look like on an array of different colors. My job is to make those screens mm. so each time the squeegee goes over, it's a different color. This is gonna look awesome because you're gonna be able to see the t-shirt through this and it's gonna be very light. I love when designs are airy, it has a lot of texture. If we overlap these, with the registration oh, marks. Yeah. You see how it aligns yes. perfectly? Oh, wow, okay, that's really cool. So once the design is printed, Harrison, you get to take over yes. and burn it in, and then you get to do the color, Yes. which has to part. be fun. Yes. I love this orange color. On this first screen, yeah. we've got the just the, the crest and the okay. orange, and then the second screen, we've got the, the back and the orange. Okay. And then it has to go through a, a spot dryer, and once it's dry, goes on in the next spot and you can keep on going from there. What is the material that's being put on the on the shirts? On the shirts itself is it's actually ink. It's, okay. It looks like paint, but it is actually ink. I think this is cool seeing just the yeah, orange. Seeing on just there. one on there. And then now it's gonna whip over. You can see you can see those little gaps where it's gonna fill in with yeah, the Yeah, that's amazing. And then it's all done. Now it just needs to uh, go through the dryer and you got a brand new shirt. Well, it was so fun to get to see the behind the scenes of how these awesome shirts and sweatshirts are made. And Steph, now we're in the store, Superior Thread Collective. And I understand this was kind of your brainchild. Yes, well, welcome to the Superior Thread Collective. Everything that we carry is meant to be kind of an upscale travel memento for travelers, tourists, and locals alike. Everything that we have apparel-wise is kind of built on different notable areas of the Lake Superior region. I love seeing these shirts all finished and folded and for sale because we just got to see them made at yes. On The Limit. So tell me about kind of the, the partnership between a bunch of different local businesses that, that makes this place possible. Absolutely. We love working with On The Limit on all of these designs. They're bringing in premium apparel, you know, lots of different styles that people are going to love. Mm -hmm. And then they're taking the beautiful artwork that we have and making it into a wearable piece of art, which is absolutely amazing. And I love that that artwork is coming from in-house. Yes. Even yourself, you designed some of the yeah. The things that people can see. It's so much fun and I think what we like is that it offers the customer a customized experience. Yeah, well, and I can tell you that I, locals like it too because I literally already bought this sweatshirt <laughs> for my husband before we Love even it. came in here today. Well, congratulations on the store. Thank you for showing us around a little bit. Absolutely, thank you for coming. And they're hosting a Gales of November Artisan Market tomorrow. It goes from 10 to 4 outside the Superior Thread Collective and Frost River. We'll clue you in on what else is happening around town this weekend in two minutes.